So now it seems that Samantha is a free agent, and Billy and Estelle might have come to, I'm sorry, um, Jerry and Estelle. Well, I don't know what the hell's going on. <laughs> Let's just roll the dice. All right, we have three number twos, so two is out. We have one number three, three is in, four is in, and five is in. Three, four, and five, and where are we going to see three, four, and five? We're going to see them in the garden. <laughs> so I just grew them yesterday. These are uh, squash. I love your squash. Oh, isn't that nice? Squash. Stephanie? Yes, it's me. Your garden looks great. You're looking good. <laughs> There's no need to kick my squash. Maybe he, she's upset because he called her the wrong name. <laughs> I'm upset because you called me the wrong name. <laughs> That's so hostile. Well, I have good reason to be hostile. I was supposed to live in this house, and this was supposed to be my garden. I was going to grow things here, and now you, and you've got baskets of things over here. Like, what have you got? Forks, napkins, what else? Basket of pot that you didn't have. <laughs> want to try. Sometimes love can make you mad, and sometimes it makes you want to die. But that would be my preference. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. What I'm trying to say is that, Estelle, I'm, I love you, but, but I still love you too. What? Yes, that's right. <laughs> I kept the eggplants as well. I've never had a plant. Don't touch those things. Those are mine. Look, I know this is my fault I, for not being able to make a decision, but you mustn't fight, fight within yourselves. You mustn't threaten each other. Of course not. Of course not. We're perfectly. I don't feel threatened by you. Remember your childhoods. You've known each other for long. Yeah. Remember that day in the sandbox, Estelle? Yeah, when I shook your neck and I twisted you around and threw you on the ground. That felt good. And I took that chunk of bulldozer and I rammed it over you and pushed you out of the sandbox and said, don't come back, Estelle. Did you remember all the profanity I said when you did that? Okay, I shouldn't have brought that up. <laughs> I thought it was a positive challenge, but it wasn't. You need to know something about her. Yes, indeed. <laughs> Jerry needs to know something about Estelle. If I roll an even number, what does he need to know about her? She plays golf. She plays golf! <laughs> <laughs> Sir, there are children here. <laughs> If I roll an odd number, what does he need to know about her? She only eats club sandwiches. What? She only eats club sandwiches. She only eats club sandwiches. <laughs> you people are sick. <laughs> if I roll an even number, she plays golf. <laughs> Jerry hates golf. If I roll an odd number, she only eats club sandwiches. It is an even number. She plays golf. <laughs> yes, you need to know about Estelle. You know Don't it. you even say it. What, not I'm perfect Estelle? What could she... She's not perfect, Jerry. Do you know... Of course I know about the toes, but that is perfection to me. Jerry, she plays... Don't say it! She plays golf! No! No! <laughs> no! She has a bag of golf clubs! No! She's got woods and irons, and she even hired a cat. 
caddy one time. <laughs> and she doesn't walk the course. No. Well, she drives. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no. You don't understand. No, don't touch me. <laughs> Do you know how much time is wasted by playing a round of golf? It takes hours. It does. It takes. <laughs> Like we 
have a new romance budding. But how will this romance feed into the other issues at play? If I roll an odd number, then our new friend Eggy is, <laughs> is very good friends with one of the other characters. Which one? Number six. Number six. Which one is that? of my loves in Twinkie. <laughs> it smells delicious. Yes. yes. Eggy Estelle. And now you, Samantha. Is that what I look like? <laughs> I didn't know I was well, so sorry. large. Well, oh, there we go. <laughs> Wait a minute. Why am I one of the three? You know I'm... 
You know what I mean? Because, because everyone has someone. And I want, and I want someone too. Hey, 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 Put hey, in the odds. All right, hey, hey, hey. Let's, uh, let's go sit down here on this bench, all right? Hey, you had a little too many Twinkies, pal. <laughs> here, take my drink. It's that cocktail based on Twinkies, but... Hey! <laughs> You're right. You're, you're calling. You're going a little mad. I'm, go, I'm going mad. I, yeah. I'm sorry. I need to compose myself. I, what about my been fretting? Because Aggie moved in. She agreed to be the housemaid, and that means I can just focus on one love. Why don't you just get rid of the other two and just focus on Aggie, right? I, I'll eat them later. Can I need to tell you something, <laughs> Billy? Yeah. Of course, you're my best friend. Any words that you say to me? I know from a place of deep love, trust, <laughs> understanding, loyalty. I know that he's you're his closest friend. Because right now I couldn't take any other news from him. <laughs> <laughs> it's only good news, right? Uh, of course. <laughs> of course. Well, oh geez, and they're switching the music again. I can only guess what it's going to be right now. Well, well, well. <laughs> If I roll an even number, he will sing his confession in the style of what music? Country. Yes. Country. country. Heavy metal. Heavy metal. Odd <laughs> number country. Even number heavy metal. Odd number country. It is an even number heavy metal. Little <laughs> Metallica. All right. <laughs> oh my God. A family. <laughs>